Let's go flying at the speed of sound. I don't know that song. I think it's Coldplay. I was going to say Coldplay. <laughs> I think you're right. Is it? it sounds terrible, so it's probably Coldplay. <laughs> Do you know who's awful? Do you know who's awful? Tell me who's awful. Train. The Drops of Jupiter guys? Yeah. Um, I know I really don't like that song. I don't think I know any other song by them. We, I heard a song. I heard a song. And uh, someone told me it was Train. <laughs> and... Oh yeah! Oh wow, you won that. That's sweet. I'm faster than a bullet. Someone told me it was Train. The melody of the song is Heart and Soul. You know that song? Uh, the piano song? Yeah, that kind of sounds familiar. Like, that's the melody for the stupid Train song. Is Heart and Soul. You can't just take it, Train! Idiots! <laughs> oh, I hate train. <laughs> we suck. Um, I I have been trying to remember where I heard this for the longest time. I think it was from Parks and Rec. If anybody out there knows, hit me up in that comment section. <laughs> um, <laughs> it's I think it was Aziz on Sorry on Parks and Rec, where he's talking about like music on his iPod, and he's like, "Gotta have some train." White people love train. Yeah, I you've told me that so many I times. I swear it's <laughs> and I've never been able to find it. Like I've Googled white people love train and it doesn't show up anywhere. Huh. I mm. feel like if that was on a Parks and Rec episode that would show up when you yeah. Googled it. I mean maybe. But I don't know man. I love that though. Just that it's so true. It's like a train. What, the white people love train? Yeah. I don't even. What else do they do besides the Drop of Jupiter song? That song. <laughs> oh, okay. they have a few That's other right. ones. I don't know. Like I said, not a train fan, so I'm surprisingly I don't know all the train hits. Um, but they've been around for a long time. Yeah, I know that. Too long. Is, yeah. Train Matchbox Twenty. That is another very like white band. Yeah. Is it the Fray? <laughs> Yeah, I really do not like the fray. I remember that you just not at all, and I I don't blame you, but I remember that, that specifically. Um, although, no no no, I will say that I liked how to save a life mm -hmm. the first like maybe four hundred times <laughs> I heard it. And then the next four hundred thousand times I heard it. <laughs> yeah, I was it. gonna say, what about <laughs> six years after it came out when it was still being played everywhere? Yeah. But the um I think it's like the song's called Cable Car or something, that their first hit. I oh, thought that it was sounds miserable because right. it's just like the way he's singing. It's just like he's just whining the whole time. That's I think that's how he sings. <laughs> well, yeah. I mean, some people like that. Yeah. It's like a very indie genre kind of. It's thing. just it's just bad alternative pop rock. It's terrible. Yeah. Take that first Think try, about Superman. All you lost, Kara. What if you could have saved um, the done? First try. I think no, about it every day. Second. Stand I'm embarrassed. Was it the second, or did we just He's video edit that out to no. make you look no. less bad? No, you can't do that. It's impossible to make me look less Go. bad. Well, I mean, when you're right, you're right. All that matters now I had to be right one of these times. This is over, <laughs> one in a row when you record. <laughs> you're either with me or against me. Is he recording? Beats the piss out of him, and then he's like, "You with me?" It's like, wait, I won. That's. I set the Basically terms. Every fight. In this game. I set the terms and conditions. <laughs> Could you imagine if like World War II ended and Germany was like, "All right, you guys with us?" <laughs> That's what just happened. That makes about as much sense as the rest of this game so far. Yeah, I will say, <laughs> like doing, like looking back at these videos we've done. And paying attention a little more to the plot, I'm like, oh, I, I kind of get what's going on. Oh, okay. Like a little bit. Yeah. Not much more, but like, <laughs> I don't know. It's weird. It's weird because like when you're doing this, we just miss things. Just kind of paying attention. Yeah. Like that's Prince. That is. Yeah. Huh. Doctor Fate. I do remember Prince. Yeah, but I thought he like didn't have a face or something. He was just like glowing. He, he wears a helmet. On. Yeah. Now he's old. To and show light. that time had passed. <laughs> What? Please. You let her die. Why I mean, you held her hand. Yeah, I was going to say. Let me fight back. 
How can there be order if Brainiac wins? Humanity breeds chaos. Brainiac you fool. Is this order. is Sparta. <laughs> the pit opens. He kicks her in. <laughs> Did you ever see 300? No, but I have watched many times 300 Spartans, which was the original oh, movie made in like the 50s or 60s. It's hilarious. It's a good movie, but it's funny because you'll you'll see them like throwing the spears and stuff, and they didn't have special effects back in the day, so you just watch guys like get nailed in the face with wooden sticks and like hold their teeth and then remember they have to pretend to die. Oh yeah. It's awesome. <laughs> it's so good. Yeah, I, I don't know if you ever watched The Three Stooges. Often, yes. Um, a lot of the stuff they did really hurt themselves. I'm sure. Like there's a, a scene where I think it was Mo falls off of a ladder. And I don't know if that was planned or not, but they left it in the, the thing. And you see, like, the hard cut that they did. Uh -huh. Because when he fell, he Five broke his ribs. And so oh. he had to, like, be in the hospital for however long before they could get back and finish that one. Oh my god. <laughs> That's awesome. You're welcome. And I do remember um, watching a documentary. What's and when they did the live shows, um, Curly was always really insistent that Mo hit him harder so the people in the back could hear. <laughs> oh my god! And it's like, that's dedication. Man. Curly was a hero. Yeah. Curly was amazing. And now what? I love Shem, too. Yeah, I, like I love Shem, Shem. Too. Curly Joe sucked. Yeah, I, I've only seen like one or two things with him in it, and he I only didn't did think a they few. were great. Shem's awesome. Did you know Shem, Mo, and Curly are brothers? Yeah. Yeah. Dr. Howard, Dr. Howard, Dr. Fine. <laughs> yeah, Dr. Howard, Dr. Fine, Dr. Howard. Yep, yeah. Oh, so they, they were. I love. Ah. That's the thing now. I don't, I don't understand. People get upset when, like. You know. Like, joking, making fun of, like, other foreign leaders and stuff now. But, like, the Stooges, like, every episode, Mo turned into Hitler. Like, <laughs> it yeah. was so funny. <laughs> that was, like, height of the war. Yep. It was awesome. <laughs> and they did, like, ridiculous slapstick stuff, yeah. too. Yeah. Like, I don't know how many episodes they did where they were poor and they were, like, living outside. <laughs> Doing a and job. They yeah. just, like, cooked like a piece of grass or something <laughs> and made soup out of it and just like ridiculous stuff like that it's too funny i just remember lots of episodes where like they're painters or stuff like that yeah. and uh man it was kind of weird because they did have a lot of episodes where they did the same sort of thing yeah but they were always funny oh yeah <laughs> it didn't matter More of that stellar voice acting. No! <laughs> <laughs> Just keep doing it. It'll break. <laughs> Wait, that's not up. The force shield concentrates its energy at your point of attack. Wonder if the voice actors were like, hey, and you might can break I get another take? And they're like, nah, keep it. <laughs> it's good. Not so fast now, are you? I guess he still is. Faster than Flash. Poor Flash. Poor Flash. <laughs> Creative, but insufficient. Decrease He's just like sitting on a tree waiting for his love to come serenade him. <laughs> Professor Xerox and his paper copy machines. <laughs> 600 copies of Superman come down, same way. Nothing will stop me from faxing the whole world. <laughs> I remember when I was younger, I used to think that when you faxed something, like it actually it went to paper. <laughs> <laughs> it's like that Mike Birbiglia thing, where he's like, say, fax something to his mom, and she's like, can, or she faxed them to him, and she's like, and then she called me, and was like, can you fax that back? That's my <laughs> only copy. <laughs> it's like, how did she think it works? Oh, well, I would. I was but you were age. a kid. <laughs> yeah, fair enough. That's a. That's an adult. I. I was. I was talking to this kid the other day, and they were talking about the situation where, like, an adult 
didn't really help them and just kind of made the situation worse. And I explained, but I explained it, I was like, look, here's probably why. Because all your life as a kid, people tell you, go ask an adult, right? If something's oh, wrong, yeah. go talk to an adult. But then one day you just become an adult. And like all you know is go ask an adult. Yeah. <laughs> There's no guidebook once you hit adulthood. So like I still look for grown ups. <laughs> yeah, I'm twenty four and I'll see someone who's twenty and I'm like, Oh you're yeah, you're a grown up. Help me. Oh yeah. There are a lot of times where I just call my dad and I'm like, Dad, yeah. You realize I don't know anything, right? Yeah. So how about you help me out with this? <laughs> oh no. It's just weird, because, yeah, that's the only advice you ever get, is go ask an adult. And then you are one. Well, you get stop, drop, and roll. <laughs> you get that. This. Stop. You. Don't touch. <laughs> Leave the area. Tell an adult. I'm sure that's the best. That uh, is about gun safety that I saw in too. fifth grade. But now we're going to get this episode taken down. Friend. That's copyright. Because Eddie sure. Eagle. No. <laughs> you said the name. <laughs> the Joker. I have to block that out and beep that <laughs> out. <laughs> I lost my friend. Oh. I've missed him ever since. Oh. oh yeah, isn't so is he Kale and Clark Kent? Cal. Cal. Yeah. Who's Clark Kent then? He is Clark now, Cal is his Kryptonian name. Clark, Clark Kent is his no like human name when he works as a human. Oh okay. This is your fault, Bruce. Oof. Cal and That's I heavy. would have beaten Brainiac. You should have followed our lead. Stop it, Diana! Millions of people wow. are trapped on that ship. We have to save them. Damn. Not with him. Such discord. No wonder humans have yet to expand their civilization beyond the confines of this tiny planet. Did you call him just of a robot? My betas are taking position all across. Throwback to last time we talked. Oh, oh man, I love that movie. I do too. I used to watch it a lot. Rendering this world a moon. So good. Unless. Now that is the right question. The right question. And he doesn't answer it. <laughs> and my last opportunity to study the effect of a yellow sun on Kryptonian cells. I love all the ridiculous stuff Will Smith does. Like he manually Even drives. And she's like, are you driving what? <laughs> An Audi. You have one hour to and then he has a bike and she's like, is that gas? <laughs> That explodes, you know. Maybe I go. <laughs> no, we'll find a way to take down Brainiac shields. We have to. We could try shorting them out, but Let's we try. need to generate an insane amount of power. Perhaps science is not the answer. Maybe, <laughs> maybe if we had Superman. <laughs> turn it off and turn it on again. Power from the rock of eternity Reboot the booter. But I need Contact our system administrator. To channel it. You have to call Something. Brainiac. How do I take down your shield? <laughs> How about the customer support? <laughs> yes, that could work. We get the shields down, then what? Cyborg said Brainiac can. controls Wait, now, the ship with all his of thoughts. them are working together. I did I cut him off from Brother Eye. Huh. It's possible I could make a signal disruptor that blocks his neural network. If you get Brainiac shields down, I really believe that this is the same voice the actor who plan. did the Teen Titans. Aquaman, Adam, get your conduct. Sounds just like it. It's been a long time since I've heard that. Good old Teen Titans. All right, Three Kings. Next time. Next time.